Good afternoon, Cosmic Culture friends. Today we have another treat from Entertainment Weekly who just gave us an exclusive look at Wonder Woman 1984 with nine photos, some of which are just clearer images from the trailer and some of which are new photos we haven't seen before. Either way, it's extremely exciting to get a look into what can only be described as DC's most anticipated movie coming out this summer. So let's take a quick look at these exclusive photos from Entertainment Weekly and talk about what we know about Wonder Woman 1984. Guys, if you're excited for Wonder Woman 1984, be sure to hit that like button and go ahead and comment down below why you are excited for this movie. So this first picture of Gal Gadot is extremely exciting as Wonder Woman in her golden armor. Now we've seen her in this pose and in this outfit before, but this one has a completely black background which we haven't seen before. And what that does for us is it really does highlight and show how awesome this armor is going to be. Obviously in the last Wonder Woman we got more of her classic armor look and in this one we're going to see that all gold armor and inside the Entertainment Weekly exclusive we also see her with the wings a little bit more clearly than we did in the trailer. It was only there for a very brief moment and even if you did freeze frame it it was extremely blurry and kind of hard to make out but it is exciting. The second one is also one that comes from the trailer, but this one comes with a little bit more of a description than we received in the trailer. Wonder Woman with her lasso of truth to the Capitol. So we see that she's in Washington DC. We don't know much context behind this, but we see she's in her original outfit from the first Wonder Woman movie. So it could be earlier on in the movie, but we did also see in the trailer a quick glimpse of Steve Trevor. So he at this point in the movie is already with her. So it'll be exciting to see how that comes into play, and of course it'll be great to see Wonder Woman whipping around her lasso of truth. And here are the wings. This is exciting guys, it's super cool to see, and yes it is the same scene that we saw in the trailer, but this is a clear cut version of it, which prior was almost impossible to get because it was so blurry, even trying to photoshop it and make it look as good as you can, we couldn't really get a clear view. But hey, this is amazing and it's gonna be so cool to see Wonder Woman finally having these wings on the big screen and it's something that a lot of people are extremely excited for the outfit the armor it all looks amazing and it's going to come together extremely nicely in this movie this photo shows Steve Trevor and Gal Gadot walking around we see that extremely attractive fanny pack sported by Steve Trevor and we can also see in his face a little bit of amazement we can presume that this is probably either really early on in his return to the movie or he's about to see something that is just crazy for him to see because we recall he wasn't alive prior you know he he didn't ever have an induction into the 80s so they're kind of dropping him in there and we saw in the trailer like everything around you is art and he's like kind of in awe about it and then he looks at the trash can he's like that's just a trash can and and that's kind of the narrative that we're going to have is him constantly seeing things that are going to be new. And that actually also brings us to the next picture, which may be following the scene as they're kind of in an airplane hangar. We see Gail Gadot and Steve Trevor taking flight in this aircraft and we just see fireworks going around him. And again, you just see that awe on Steve Trevor's face. Something that is going to be a huge narrative in this movie is going to be him just constantly discovering new things from the 80s and that's a huge part of what this movie is is 1984 and the 80s and that vibe and Steve Trevor's going to be immersed in all of it as we go throughout the movie okay this picture is extremely important and I'll tell you why if you look on the desk you see kind of out of focus a blurry object that is described as ancient artifacts so look at cheetah Look at what we know about her, about Barbara from the trailer. She was a very nervous, normally dressed, kind of shut-in individual. And in this picture, she doesn't have her glasses anymore. Her hair is all did, and she's wearing this crazy look-at-me dress, which isn't something that she would wear based off of the information we know about her. She's also hanging out with Maxwell Lord. So something here is going on, and there was a huge plot leak that's talking about this artifact and how this artifact is going to grant wishes and how Maxwell Lord, Barbara, and Wonder Woman all in some point in the movie use it to make wishes. We can assume maybe that's how Steve Trevor makes his return into the movie and also how Cheetah gets her powers and how she has an entire personality change throughout the movie as we can see here. So this artifact that we see on the desk could potentially be a huge point of the plot in Wonder Woman 1984 and they're giving it to us here in this Entertainment Weekly exclusive. So, again, it was a plot leak, 
But if there was any truth to it, this artifact that we are seeing on this desk is very, very important. This image that we're looking at now is also one of the first images that we did get from Wonder Woman 1984, and it is that entire mall scene where Gal Gadot's Wonder Woman is in the mall fighting some bad guys. She kind of hides herself by knocking at the cameras and kind of keeping her own and keeping herself anonymous as much as Wonder Woman could. And we see that this is a huge scene at probably some point in the beginning of the movie as well as she is dressed in her normal outfit. And we're trying to probably figure out at this point how Wonder Woman fits into the 1980s area. Seeing that she's been around this whole time, she's lived from Steve Trevor all the way to now. And we're probably going to start seeing how she fits into the world through this area as she just does some crime fighting in the mall. This photo is always nice to see as we see Patty Jenkins, the director of Wonder Woman 1984, on set with Gal Gadot and they're talking about obviously the movie and the plays and everything that's going on around. It's always cool to see that behind the scenes look and how Patty Jenkins has done such a great job with the Wonder Woman movies and we have seen how much she's been enjoying it so it's always good to get a look at that as well. And of course the cover of the Entertainment Weekly is Gal Gadot dress in her gold outfit with the wings very clearly behind her and the lasso of truth in her hand. It's a new pose we haven't seen before and a new angle and let me tell you again, talked about it already, this suit looks amazing. If you're a Wonder Woman fan you will be excited to see this suit. If you're not a Wonder Woman fan it's still something pretty cool to look at. DC is going all out with Wonder Woman. It is not a low budget movie by any means and it is one of their starship movies franchises right now. Wonder Woman did such a good job. People were so excited for it. And there is just an undeniable amount of hype behind Wonder Woman 1984 right now. Just like how we saw at CCXP Brazil, when they showed the trailer to the world, there was so much excitement for it from the cast, from the director, and from the fans. This is definitely not going to be a movie we want to miss. So, again, let me know what you think about these pictures down in the comments below and how excited you are for Wonder Woman 1984. Thank you so much for watching until the end of the video. If you enjoyed it, hit that like button and be sure to subscribe. We will be covering all major movie news right here on Cosmic Culture.